The shield is up, the survivors are safe, and Ramirez is ready for action. Huh, not a bad start. Mock, let's see that status report. Okay, okay, uh, good reporting. Just one small note. Let's maybe try not to cry in the war room. Even if the storm is closing in and our power reserve indicators are flashing red, which is not energy efficient at all, but none of that matters because we've got Vendor Tech on our side. Our sensors are picking up an active Vendor Tech research facility in this zone. Lead the way, Commander. Don't tell me what's inside. I want it to be a surprise. Axe! Oh yeah, you got the goods. Yeah, swallow the phone. The fate of the world now rests on you, me, and some guy from tech support. Who, let's face it, may no longer be with us. I've marked his last known location on the minimap. Let's check it out and hope for the best.
are the best. Keep up the good work. This does not inspire confidence. Let's see what's inside. And this inspires even less confidence. Let's take a look around. Nice job! Let's explore! It looks like it was abandoned. A secret research lab! Finally! Huh, this is vendor tech equipment. What's it doing here? Check out that computer. Whoa, this is interesting. In the lead-up to the storm, Vendertech Labs began developing experimental weapons. Normally, I find that kind of thing disturbing, but these days, I'm all about it. It looks like this lab was working on something called an atmospheric laser. I've downloaded the schematic. Let's test it out. Okay, to start, we'll need some blue glow to power the weapon. There should be some in this lab. Then, I've got a hunch we'll want to stock up on bullets. There are two ways to craft bullets. You can open your inventory and select the bullets you want to craft. Or you can hold reload on your current weapon to auto-craft the bullets you need. Let's craft some bullets. Yeah. Nope. We're all set. I've marked the target on your map. 